host with the most from any PA's local eats and takeouts, powered by Wyoming Valley. We're here, as you can see behind us, we're on the Dallas Highway. We're at the Ranch Wagon. This place has been known to, this has been here for a long time, so the locals know it. So check it out if you have not been out here. Let's, let's go see what's In going on. outside at, at the Ranch Wagon. <clears throat> now, I ordered the Rubin Dog. I'm not exactly quite sure what's on it. I saw Swiss cheese, Thousand Island. Um, so it's gonna be interesting. So we're gonna check that out. I got a Coke. Well, it's RC. So, but yeah, it's it's gonna be interesting, this Reuben dog. Now it's been a while since we've been out on the road. Last time we were at Kate's place, so pretty soon you know, you'll be seeing that come up on the, on the, web, on the Facebook page. And uh, I got some Good things going on we're, that we're working on for Wyoming Valley Reviews for both NEPA local eats and takeouts and NEPA's home cooking groups so stay stay tuned to those now today I wasn't sure if we're gonna do a, if I was gonna do a review tonight because it was when I got out of work it was actually raining about 530 it was storming up in Jessup but down here it's pretty good it, you know the sun's out and we're gonna give you a show we're gonna show you what that what it looks like. Well, right now you can see behind me I'm sitting there over near the uh, kind of picnic and picnic table type you know, setup. So uh, we're going to give everybody a, a glance around to see what's going on, see the roads. And yeah, it's, it's going to be good. I'm, I can't wait to try that, that Reuben dog. Right, so we have 689. All right. Thank you. Okay, guys. Now my order just came up. Now, with camera number two, look at that. I got my drink. It's an RC. Got these fries. Now, let's check out this losing dog. Wow, look, look at that dog, guys. That looks, that looks pretty good. All right, just get a better look at it this way. Ugh. All right, you see that sauerkraut there, the, the dressing, the, the hot dog. All right, let's jam into this bad boy and let's see how it tastes. Let's see how it tastes, guys. First with the fries. Fries are nice and hot. Now the fries are not fresh cut. I mean, they're not like home cut fries. They're, they're just, they're normal fries. But they are, they are when they are nice and hot. I'll bring this in. Okay, now I don't know if you heard, everything came to like six and change. Oops, can't let my napkins blow away. All right, I'm not sure how to eat this bad boy. All right, guys, look at this. Look at this dog. Hmm. Mm. No, it wasn't bad. You can taste the kraut, the Thousand Island, which which has a good blend to it. The dog tastes like a beef dog. And I'm not 100%, but I'm 99.999%. Tastes like a beef dog. The <coughs> excuse me, the bun isn't toasted, but it's steamed. It does feel warm. It's also probably from everything that's on that hot dog. Now. It is different. Now guys, if you, if no one's been out here to the ranch wagon, it's on the Dallas Highway. Up past uh, the McDonald's, the Burger King.
nice things if you want. And you could get out of your car, you could sit at the table. Or they, they bring it right to your car. You could sit in your car. But like, I don't want to do a review. I'm sitting in my car. It's nice out. Oh. I want to give a shout out to a friend of mine who follows both the videos, the food videos, and the and the cooking videos. Adrian, hello. So hello, Adrian. Thank you for watching and supporting the brands and Mommy Valley Reviews. We're gonna hit this one get back to I'm getting into this. I'm tearing into this hot dog here. And uh, I've got my fries. I've got the RC. We haven't jammed into that yet. But I just wanted to give you guys a show, a show with a close-up show to to see what's going on. I'm gonna take a minute and look around. There's people sitting up on the thing, up on the you know the where you can eat. There's the waitress lady. It's still nice out, so that's a good thing, guys. We're really tearing into this hot dog. And with all the Thousand Island dressing on it, the, the, you know, the Swiss cheese, the sauerkraut. That was going to be messier. But really, it's not. So, so that's a good thing. I'm going to try this RC. I haven't had RC in. I can't remember when. Fresh, refreshing taste. I'm looking at the fries. I don't believe they're they're fresh cut, but I could be wrong. They are good though. Uh, how was your day, guys and gals? Mine was. Mine was work. After I do this, I'm gonna head home. Relax and get ready for the weekend. Hopefully the weather stayed nice. Look at that fry. It's a good fry. I was debating if I wanted to go up the road and check out any other spots, but probably not. Because looking at my other camera, it's 7 o'clock. So yeah, after this, I'm going to head home, take care of the Goldilocks, and edit this video, put it all together. Getting stuff, guys. Yep, I don't know, might be a birdie behind you. I gotta give a big fry, thumbs up to the ranch wagon here for the Reuben dog. Now it looks like there is, looks like yeah, that's their, their running special right now. The Reuben dog, large French fry, large soda. I remember years ago, they, I mean, they may still sell, but they have t-shirts. I had one years ago, but it's, it's long gone.
All right, guys, this is the last bite of the Bourbon Dog. I'm down two. My fries, but none of my fries, and my soda, and cars come in and out. Uh, so I wonder. Now tomorrow we'll be down to Hickory Run State Park. With, excuse me, doing a wedding with simple ceremonies of any PA. And, excuse me. I don't know if we're going to hit another review this weekend. Well, we probably will, but I just don't know where. And when we're going down to Hickory Run, on the way back, maybe if there's a something, we'll see. Oh, but when I place my order, you can either pay with cash or card. So, remember that, you have to never carry cash, you can do a card. I paid cash. Today. RC is pretty good. Yeah, it's nice out today, guys. Now I'm getting tired. Ranch wagon was always known as like where to get a good foot long hot dog. So, in kudos to the guys at the ranch house, ranch wagon, ranch house, ranch wagon. I'm gonna wrap this up and I'm gonna head either to our next adventure. I'm heading home, one of the two, which could be another adventure, and if I want to cook in the kitchen. So. Thank you for checking out any PA local eats and takeouts powered by Wyoming Valley Reviews. We're going to see you next time on the road. You take care.